Hey folks, Tivik here and welcome back to Minecraft Season 4, Episode 11. Today, I want to get started with a few things. I want to start working with this quartz stuff and start making some cool items. So, I'm going to set up a storage system. Uh, Applied Energistics uh, has some cool stuff. So, we will need a little bit of everything, so let's get some of that. I'm gonna need a diamond. Just one, I think. Yep. And, uh, yeah, might as, well, might, might as well get that. We will also need a stick. I'm pretty sure I have one here. Somewhere. No? Ah. Yeah, I updated Steve's cards and we'll no longer get these oak logs and stuff like that. Let's get one of these. And my dog just went mad. One moment. Right, that was odd. Dog went mad for some reason. Well, I don't understand dogs that well. So, let's make one of these cutting knives. We'll need that first. And now, let's see. We will need some gold. Uh, let me see. I'm going to need a couple of these. So, I might as well just make three now. I'm also going to need three of those and redstone on the sides. This makes basic processor assemblies. And we'll also need to make one with a diamond for an advanced processor assembly. Cool. Let's uh, smelt these up. They will soon arrive in here. There's the first one of these. And now we'll also need to make some... Um, it's called flux stones or flux stones, which is basically um, let's see, four of these, four of these, and four of these, will make, yeah, not four, but they make each of these. Now, for the controller, we need to do this, and then put this one in the middle. We have an ME controller, that's the basic thing, you will need this one to get this system going. It's powered off. Good. Um, now we are going to make an ME access terminal. For that we'll need a few more things. We'll need to get some dust out of this. Oh, that's not intended. Oh, stop it. Can't output that. Nether quartz dust. I'm gonna need. Um, well, I'm gonna need some more. So I'm gonna make some of this. Not too much. And I think this is a shapeless recipe. So, well, mm -hmm. we've got some more silicon. I suppose that's good. Um, I think it's a shapeless rep recipe. So let's try it out. Mm -hmm. This, this, and this. Yep. Flux dust. Or flux and flux. Flukes? I have no idea how it's supposed to be. Now, to make the conversion matrix, I will need, um, let's see, this one. I will need the basic processor, two dust, some iron. We can do that. Basic processor, dust on each side, iron. And one of those, and one of those. Conversion matrix. We will now also need some glass. Uh, my inventory is so full with stuff here, it's almost sad. Let's, um, let's get rid of the extra swords and stuff like that. Yeah, not really much more I can do. We will need to make some cabling, and that's done using this dust here, and glass. Well, we'll need more glass. Do I have more glass? No. Sand. Not a lot of sand. So I'm going to pulverize cobblestone. I think that's still pulverizing to sand, right? Yep. And that can output to this one. It will get some gravel as well. Oh yeah, and this one needs to output as well. Is that not the one? Uh, 
Um, oh well. There we go. I don't really need that much, but I might as well just craft it up. Now we need to place these with this matrix there, that there, and we have an access terminal. The last thing I want to make requires two of these. A chest, which I should have over here. No. What's in this one? Oh, tools. Um, let's make a chest then. Uh, I hate juggling inventory. There we go. And we can get rid of that. That one can go in there as well. Not that. Um, two of these with, let's see, I think it's one each of these, and then iron around. No? Let's see. It's one of these drives. Oh, it's glass. Well, that's good. I made some more. There we go. And we have an ME drive. Now, obviously, this is not enough. Um, but with this, I can set this up like this. Now, if this one had power, all these would start talking. So I'm thinking I will want to have that terminal just in the middle here. So, let's see access terminal there, and then we dig down here. Uh, I'm thinking... We'll have to dig out an area below here. It doesn't have to be very big. This is gonna be temporary for the moment. And we need to go all the way over here to get power. I can do that. It's just digging. Oh. That was not what I intended. Ah, water. Okay. Have to rethink. We'll put it again like this. Let's see. Right. <clears throat> there will be water there as well. So if I can tap into the power system here. From there and go straight out. Something like this. I'm gonna need a lot of power wiring and stuff like that. I'm gonna put the controller so that I can easily access it. And then we put ME cabling there, which makes these two connect. And then we put the drive... I suppose we can do this. Yeah, that'll look cool. Now we're gonna need some of these redstone energy cells, and this is destabilized redstone, okay. Did I put away my wrench now? Yes, I did. Gonna need more than these. Oh well, we'll figure it out. One, two, three, and four more. Okay. So, why don't I just craft that up? I think I made some more hardened glass. Well, I did a lot of hardened glass. And I have electrum. Only two. So, I got a good tip that just smelting like this. 
and this in the induction smelter will produce electrum. And obviously that is smarter because I don't have to mas uh, macerate or uh, do anything like that. And it saves some time. Okay. Let's uh, get rid of the glass. And craft up this. Thirty-two. Well, that should last for a while. Uh, we probably don't have enough to fill them. But that can be arranged in this one. Um, let's uh, switch that to... Orange? No? There we go. Just empty it like so. Oh, it's not empty. I need another one of these. Yeah, we can do that. Let's see, that's a tin ingot, I think. Let's see. Uh, just throw this away. Portable tank. I can pick that up again. And this can empty into this. Perfect. Now... We get this. Um, I put that lava away, I think. And this will start melting this into. So it's using seven energy units. I should really put that one up one. Hmm. Before I use up too much, I will. Like so. I do like to see the status of these, even though it's um, not as pretty. Now we can close this up now. I'm gonna move the power lines later, as long as we don't... Well, it doesn't really matter. Um, now this one is using up quite some energy, and I don't really need this at the moment. Because this will still power. See? It's got these two in the system. Perfect. Now, I do need a few more things. I will need some storage. Some storage. Um, I want to go for the 16k, but they require quite a lot. So let's go for the single, simple one. So we need one of these basic processor again. And uh, let me just clean up my inventory. I went ahead and crafted the first one. Um, well, the first couple. And I'm gonna show you this. Um, let's get some more redstone. I have some redstone, no? Uh, I don't know if I have enough crystals, but I will try and get some more. Uh, one, two, three, four, five of these. Now we have a total of eight storage cells. Now, if I wanna go and make a 4K one, I will need a storage segment. That's three and basic processors. So we're gonna need to make a few more of these basic processors as well. Um, in fact, we need to make two. So, let's see. I'll also need two silicon. So I'm just gonna smelt this oh the silicon. And we'll pick it up. And one more. Thank you. As you might have noticed, um I have removed my tree farm and most of that old house that I had there, except for one block I see. Um that's because I want to change a few things around. 
Why did I have an extra? I need to make one more storage cell, don't I? Yeah. Let's do that. Um, so I need one more. One more. Uh, one more of these. Actually, two more of these. That obviously means that we need two more of those. Bleeding quartz though. Wish I could get some quartz ore, but no. Let's see. There we go. We got these now. Um, yeah, we don't have enough Certus Quartz, do we? No. Okay, so I'm not going to be able to make all these for now, but at least I can make one more. So we got... Actually, this will probably work. Let's see. We have one more storage cell. So, three... Let's say it's a 4K one. Three, a processor, redstone, oh wait, and glass. And we have storage segments. Now these storage segments with iron and glass, and again, redstone. It's like this, and then three iron in the bottom, I think. Did I miss that again? Yep. There we go. We have one, two, and they don't stack, by the way. Three of these storage blocks. The cool thing with this is that I can plop them in there. And now we can store quite a lot of units. Well, items. Look at this. This one is using up 143 bytes from these. So let's just dump everything in here. Now, I want to move everything, and I will, but it's going to take up a lot of storage. So just let's try it with this and see how the storage fills up. I'm not even using these, we're only to 1k. And that's very, very nice. I wonder if I can... Nope. Can't. But I can put it in like this. So what happens if I grab all this? And all this, except for the coal, because I'm going to be smart and keep the power running. It's now using 18 units, which is not enough. Um, my system is not going to be able to handle that, I think. Actually, why is it going up again? I think it's when I add a lot. Yeah, when I add a lot of items, it slows down, or rather, uses a lot. The cool thing is I can just pick items out of this. Now it's using up 21 units. And this one is trying to charge up. And these will soon not be enough, I can tell you that. You can get these. We're still not over the first storage unit. So I envision me having a rack of these ME drives and we can go as big as 64k once we have the materials but these are expensive. Storage blocks, storage segments, hundreds of them. Yeah, so for this we're gonna need power. Lots of power and to get that we are going to need to do a few things. We are going to have to 
Well, I suppose we can get some going with uh, with build craft. Hmm, how are we for steel? We have 64. How are we for coal coke? Got some. We can use the steel to make steel plates. And these steel plates make steam ovens, disposal tracks, but high pressure boilers and liquid fueled fireboxes. Now, this is going to be a challenge to get this running properly. We're going to have to live on these kind of uh, engines for a while. This one isn't going to cope, is it? Hmm. Yeah, this one definitely isn't. So we're gonna need some bigger engines. Yep. And for that, I'm gonna go back to doing some... Oh dear, it switched off, didn't it? Yeah, it's now flickering. It's because it's almost out of power. Well, hopefully it will get back. I'm gonna need a lot of power to keep the whole system going, so I'm gonna have to make some kind of offline backup storage for... Uh, for the items that are uh, less, um, well, for the items that are critical, such as charcoal, for the fuel engines, if that's what I'm going for, but liquid, yeah. Um, anyhow, we are ne going to need to make some biomass, and uh, I'm going to look up something real quick. Um... Yeah, biomass is of course made in the fermenter using fertilizer and mulch. It can use a lot of things. I think wheat can barely be used. I wonder. No. But wheat can be used. And that's easy enough to grow. I need to put that in the... In the... Or is it fermenter? Wood mulch, compost, fertilizer. Um, fertilizer is... Oh, it's just appetite and sand or ash and sand. Or saltpeter and sand and dirt. Hmm, this is going to be a bit of a challenge. I'll figure something out though. I need this one to stop filling up. Well, these are not using any more energy now. So once that one has filled up with energy, we should be good. I want to attach this one to the system. I think that's the safest thing to do. So right now we're not entirely good to go on this. Um, Not there, but there. And using the tool to rotate can then... Um, is this one attached to the power system, by the way? Nope. I wonder if I have more liquid ducts. I have. Good, good. Um, another liquid duct, and we need to whack it so that this one fills this one as well. And then we can f lock this up again. Like so. And of course, I need to close this one. One more. Perfect. Where are my livers? And charcoal. Uh, 
a little bit of extra power from this one. Uh, we can turn this one for when we need it for the rolling machine, but for now I'm going to need it for energy because this one cannot keep up. It's turning on and off. Oh well. Anyhow, let me set up my tree farm again, and I'm going to put it more on the other side of this building, thinking over here. And I'm gonna... F oh, creeper. Boom. Ah, griefer. I'm gonna put the rail up somewhere around here, and uh, I will try to automate it to smelt some charcoal. I'll figure something out. I saw a spider. Anyhow, I'll be right back with you guys. Only got a few more moments here for this recording, but I thought I'd show you some of what I've been planning to do. Now, this one is running off coal coke, which is alright, but... Where is the stuff that he's dropping off? Did he pick it up again? Yeah, he did. <laughs> I need to reconfigure that thing. Um, on the red side, it can never back from... I'll just put it to pick up from the storage slots. Now that transfers to and this empties out. Now this oak wood we need to take out and put into some form of powered item that could produce... Hmm, I'm not sure yet. I I think I want to make it something like... <laughs> I do want to split this one up. And... Uh, can I turn this one off? No. But railers will do. Um, can I tell it to just take... No. So I will need to separate this. Uh, I can offload everything from this one here and move that into a specific... Uh, let's see. Each color, each side has its own slots. Each color has its own. Yeah, because if I set this one to another color like blue, it will only... Let's see. Wow. I've got a big tree to cut down now. Um, no, I think we're going to have to do this and uh, do some filtering. And then we can put another station here that does only fueling. I can do that. I will need to build one more of these cargo managers, but that's not a big deal. Wow, look at this. Um, yeah, so I'll be working on this between episodes and see what I can set up. I don't know what the yield of this one is. It's 87, needs diamonds to repair, that's fine. Um, so one more cargo manager and one more distributor will be a plan. Anyhow, I'll work on setting something up and I'll see you in the next episode. Take care. Bye-bye.